We'll guide you through how to send and transfer files from a phone to an Android TV. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. This is convenient to go and do as you can get them on your TV. So to go and get started on your TV, you want to tap right to the top and we need to go and select apps like this. And in apps, you need to come down and open up the Google Play Store. We do need to go and get an app to do this. And you want to go to the top right and you want to go and select search. And the app you're going to want to get is called Send Files to TV. You'll get it suggested, it's this one here. Click on it, and then what you want to do is go and press install like so. When it's finished, we can then press open. Now what you need to do is come onto your phone, make sure you're connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Open the Play Store, press search at the bottom, and then you want to go and type in send files to TV. Here it is here, we can go and press install. When it's finished, press open to the right. You can read through it or press skip in the bottom right. We'll need to go and give it permission to our files here. And we can press allow here as well, and then switch this on. Then you can go and press back. Here we're gonna go and press send. On the TV, you can go and press skip in the bottom left like this. You'll need to go and give it the permissions that the TV goes and asks for. Scroll to the bottom and select permissions. Then when, when it says files and media, you can click there. Make sure you select allow management of all files and come back. On the phone, you can then go and find the files you want to do this with. Come back to your phone and you can choose the files. For example, DCIM is gonna be your photo. So I'm gonna come in here and go and find some. I want to transfer this one, so I'll go and tap on it like this, and then we can go and select the TV at the top, and it'll transfer. And you can see there it is. You've now successfully gone and transferred it. You can then go and click on it, and you can go and open it. You will need to go and have the app, though, which can do it. So I need to get a photo viewer. 